the numbers on Mike Miner. You see the overall record, four and ten with a 5.7 ERA. The opponent's batting average, 2.93. Now, Mike Miner is what he is. He pitches to contact. He's that veteran presence with all the young arms in the starting rotation. And he slices through that high heater. He is three for 20 in September. Miner goes to work now against Reynolds. Here's the first pitch, and Reynolds sends it out to deep left field, and Friedel back on this one, and there it goes, a home run for Brian Reynolds. On the first pitch he sees, Reynolds homers to left, and the Pirates lead one to nothing. Must be listening to us down there, Joe. Bo both hitters, the first two hitters, Kevin Newman and Brian Reynolds up there ready to swing the bat. The first fastball that both of them swing RC, they put good swings on. This one, Brian Reynolds was able to get a, a fastball elevated just above the strike zone. He put a good swing on it, barreled that thing up pretty good. I got out of here in a hurry. 22nd home run for Brian Reynolds. Swing and a miss. Gets his second strikeout. And we see that uh, that's a high breaking ball this time. Castro and Hayes go. The ball popped up. Against a gray, cloudy sky, Farmer. Reynolds homers. See if the Reds can get that run back. Weiss's ERA is up there, but it's getting a little late to move it much. Wilson's going to fill up that strike zone. His walk rate since coming back up from the minors in July is among the lowest in the league. We're going to see a lot of fastballs. Fastball, slider, curveball, changeup mix. Gets a strikeout to start the bottom half of the first inning. Grounded to Hayes. Castro to Chavis. Jake Fraley is retired. And we're through an inning from Cincinnati. It's the Pirates one and the Reds nothing. Lined into left. Allen with a good jump. Dives and makes a catch. Greg Allen sprinting toward the line. Diving headlong and he snared it. That was a good one. That was a really good one. Full extension laying out. <laughs> Great anticipation and jump from Allen. Going towards the left field line. Two ball, two strike count. Miner turns it loose and a swing and a miss. Good change up away. Castro down on strength. Robinson sets away. Swing and a miss, and he got him with a changeup. Nice pitch from Mike Miner. He punches out the final two here in the third. His first three up, three down inning. One nothing Pirates. That sets up Jason DeLay, the number nine hitter with two on and two out. Payoff to DeLay. Popped up. Right side, outfield grass Lopez. Miner strands a boat. Chip over second, base hit. Back to back innings, the leadoff man is on. Pop up shallow, Allen racing in, and Allen does it again. Thinking that if Steer reads this right, he might score. There was no chance. Greg Allen certainly seems to have it. And now to the plate, the one two pitch. And Aquino swing, put the charge into it, left field and deep, and it is gone. Two-run shot for Aristide Zacchino, his eighth home run of the year, and it puts the Reds on top two to one. I like the swing that he had in his first at bat, and I like that one even better. But that's what made me say about the home run. But well, actually, Aquino had a couple of good swings in that first at bat. One he pulled foul, the one he lined to left that Allen made the diving catch on. There's that little toe tap, which allows him to get into good hitting position and no panic. There's the tap. And you know he's got the power. Golfo has walked and struck out tonight. Here's the center of the pitch. Swinging a fly ball to left. Deep. Friedel back. Warning track. And gone! Into the first row in left. Rodolfo Castro hits a three-run homer. And the Pirates take the lead back. It's 4-2. to two. How about that, Joe? How about some groceries for Charles Dyer? Congratulations, Charles, getting your grocery gift card. 
Congratulations to Rodolfo Castro. Nice piece of hitting. Got something up a little bit that uh, was a change up, upper part of the zone, and with a couple of guys out on those bags, driving in the runs. We call those stakes. Castillo was hitting 246 with three homers in 35 games with the AAA Indianapolis Indians. Swinging a fly ball to left. This one's hit well. Friedel back on this one. It's gone. A line drive. Home run. Diego Castillo. And the Pirates pick up two more here in the fifth. It's six to two Pirates. Welcome back, Diego. No kidding. We asked to, to see his first hit since being back, and he sure does go ahead and deliver. I was just talking about Key Brian Hayes coming across to score to give us one more run. Diego says, you know what, I'll see your one and I'll give you another. What a beautiful looking swing and a low line drive homer right there. Impressive power from Diego Castillo. Very few are leaving their seats. Very faint precipitation. Freed on the left and finally the red solve the riddle of Greg Allen. Drops in front of him and Friedel a lead off base knock. Bases are loaded with two away. Alejo Lopez is struck out looking and grounded out to first base. Chippy scooped and lost on the transfer. Friedel scores. Bases still loaded. Six to three. A ball up the middle and watch Noonan. You see him kind of take a deeper route. He should be cutting across and getting that ball right away. He's already in a pull position. But he starts after a ball and then he kind of redirects himself and catches that ball in the outfield grass. Stevenson sets his 0 1. Swinging a line drive to center. Reynolds makes the catch. Came on a few steps and met it, and that ends the inning. So the Reds get a run. Strand three. Crows back to the mound for the Pirates. Strike three called. Lefties on the Reds bench. 2 2 pitch. Swung on and line to right, but right at Sawinski for the second out. Bouncing ball to third, and Hayes will step on the bag, raise it in Cincinnati. Will Crow gets the save. Pirates raise the Jolly Roger. They hit three homers Reynolds, Castro, Castillo.